Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Cynthia with Keep Calm Couponing. So I headed over to Walmart to work on my weekend warrior bonus. I got $5 for, I think it was 15 or 18 offers. I'll pop it up on the screen. And then my bigger bonus was $10 for 38 offers. Drop a comment down below. Let me know what you got. And if you've started already, uh, you know, getting your offers for that bigger one. Y'all, it's been a hot minute since I've been to Walmart. I actually went the other day and it's just been taking me so long to like edit everything. But I'm almost 98% sure all the deals I shared in this video are still good to go. Like I checked them not so long ago. Um, Y'all, just too much happening. Like both our cars, batteries died same day. Husband was using my car to get to work. And then that afternoon, my battery died. Like, it's been a hot ass mess. So, your girl's been in the house. I left the house one day this week. Um, And, you know, why not go to Walmart when I leave the house? Because what else What else am I going to do? Um, I was excited to go until I decided to go to a different Walmart. And I was not happy about it. Like, it was, it was not great. Nothing was in stock. Everything was a hot ass mess employees just didn't care that they was at work like it was a mess um but anyways I did what I could so in this video though I shared like a small haul that I did like all the deals that I picked up but then I also shared some additional deals towards the end um and those are formatted pretty much the way my um food deal videos are so definitely stick around for that and yeah <laughs> First thing I picked up were on these Aussie hair care products priced at 97 cents each. I picked up a total of two which brought me to a dollar and 94 cents. I'll get two dollars back from my bada making them both completely free. Next a deal I picked up were on these Old Spice body washes. These are priced at a dollar and 97 cents each. Picked up a total of three which brought me to 5.91. I'll get back five dollars from my bada making the final cost 91 cents or just about 30 cents each. Next deal I picked up were on these Clorox disinfectant wipes. These are um, also in the travel section priced at 97 cents each. You want to pick up a total of two which will bring you to $1.94. You'll get $3.50 from Swagbucks making them free and a $1.56 money maker. Now you can do this deal um, twice in a month. Now I completely forgot and only picked up two so I was a little salty about that. Um, so definitely pick up four for a little bit of a bigger um, money maker. Next deal are on these Arm & Hammer uh, scent boosters, the light ones, priced at $5.48. You'll get back, a oh, buying two brought, you, brought, <laughs> brought me <sighs> to $10.96. You'll get $2 back from Ibotta, $2.71 back from Checkout 51, and then $5 back from Swagbucks, making the final cost $1.24 or $0.62 cents each. Next deal are on these Febreze small spaces. These are priced at... What are these priced at? $234. You'll get back. No, $324. Y'all, I'm a hot mess. Just bear with me, please. <laughs> You'll get. So they're $324. You'll get $230 back from my bottom, making the final cost $0.94. Cents. Next deal are on these Lemmy Shine dish detergent boosters. These are priced at $4.97 each. You want to pick up a total of two, which will bring you to $9.94. You'll get $4.97 back from Ibotta, making the final cost $4.97 or $2.49 each. Definitely a decent deal if it's something that you typically pick up. Half off is always pretty nice. There's a whole bunch of other rebates over on Ibotta for um, products in this line. So definitely check that out if these are things that you typically pick up. Next deal are on these Mr. Clean Clean Freak. Uh, what is this? The refills priced at $3.94 each. You want to pick up a total of two, which will bring you to $7.88. You'll get back $4 from Ibotta, making the final cost $3.88 or $1.94 each. So the next deal I was supposed to pick up was the fly ribbons and I accidentally picked up the fly trap instead. Um, the fly ribbons are $2.24. I know you've seen this deal a million times, but you'll get the $2 back from my bottom, making it just 24 cents. My, uh, I was, I was about to cruise. I picked up <laughs> the, the ribbon. Those are $3.88. So after the $2, I mean, not the ribbon, I picked up the what is this? The wrap, like the window wrap. After I bought it, they came out to a dollar and eighty-eight cents. Not too bad. I was a little salty. Um, I'm gonna see if I could use it. If not, sis is going back because 
I don't, if I don't need it, I want my money back. <laughs> um, but 188 is still pretty decent for the item. Like if it's something that you need. Next deal is on the Chobani uh, Zero Sugar Yogurts. These are priced at $1.22 each. You want to pick up a total of two, which will bring you to $2.44. You'll get $1.22 back from Ibotta, making the final cost $1.22 or $0.61 cents each. Next deal are on these Chobani yogurt drinks. These are priced at $1.78 each. You want to pick up a total of two, which will bring you to $3.56. You'll get $1.78 back from Ibotta, making the final cost $1.78 or just $0.89 cents each. There are two separate rebates, one for um, the yogurt drinks and then one for the zero sugar yogurt drinks. And then there's another one for yogurt shakes. They all kind of look alike um, as far as packaging, but the, the shakes are $2.47. I think those are like the blue bottles. Um, so for those buying two of those will bring you to 494. You'll get 247 back from Ibotta, making the final cost 247 or 124 each. Definitely pretty decent if you typically be picking this up. Um yeah, and all those breakdowns will be in the Google Doc. Next deal are on these Plezzy juices. These are priced at 278 each. I picked up a total of two, which brought me to 556. You'll get three dollars back from Ibotta, making the final cost 256 or a dollar and twenty-eight cents each. Next deal are on these Heinz beef gravies. These are priced at $2.48. You'll get 50 cents back from Ibotta, making the final cost $1.98. So I also went ahead and picked up a few of the mac and cheese deals. Um, I have I picked them up almost every haul because the girls love mac and cheese. Um, I think there's like four or five different rebates. I'll pop it up on the screen. I didn't include them in the Google Doc because I have been including them. Um, drop a comment down below. Let me know if you typically pick these up or you just skip this rebate altogether. Next deal are on these Propel Waters. These are priced at $168 each. You want to pick up a total of two, which will bring you to $336. You'll get a dollar back from Ibotta. And then I had a dollar and 25 cent uh, survey over on Brand Club, which will bring the final cost to $111 or just 55 cents each. Remember, if you have multiple surveys over on Brand Club for a specific brand, you wanna make sure you get two different varieties. So for example, for these waters, you wanna get two different flavors. If you get two different flavors, you'll be able to unlock two surveys, but if you get the same flavor, only one survey will unlock. Um, but 55 cents each is definitely pretty decent. Next deal are on these seventh generation products. So the store that I went to said that they carry these items and then they didn't <laughs> so i'm hoping to go back at some point um to pick these up before the rebates expire um but for this deal you want to pick up one of the fabric softeners priced at 547 one of the dish soaps priced at 353 and one of the disinfectant sprays priced at 447 buying all three of these will bring you to 1347 you'll get um separate rebates for each one over on ibotta for a total of four dollars and fifty cents You'll also get $1.50 back from Shopmia and then $9 total back from Fetch, making the final cost free and a $1.53 moneymaker. Next deal are on these uh, Curad, what are you say, like the self-adhesin wraps. These are priced at $1.97. You'll get back 455 kicks, which is $1.82, making the final cost just 15 cents. Next deal are on these Goya Adobos. These are priced at $1.88. You'll get 50 cents back from I no 30 cents back from Ibotta, making the final cost $1.58. Next deal are on these Pillsbury Soft Bay Cookies. These are priced at $3.18. You'll get a dollar back from Ibotta, making the final cost $2.18. Now there are um surveys over on Brand Club for this item, like for this item, but I maxed out of my surveys but definitely check your accounts if you haven't done them already to help you lower your out-of-pocket cost next deal are on these pillsbury biscuits these are priced at a dollar and 48 cents each you want to pick up a total of two which will bring me to 296 you'll get two dollars back from ibotta plus a dollar back from shop me i'm making it free and a four cent money maker now some accounts have um on ibotta that you need to buy two for this deal so It'll just um, cost you a little bit if that's the case, but definitely pick these up if you can, if you have that $1 rebate. Next deal are on these Chomps Meat Sticks. These are priced at $2.28. You'll get $2.48 back from Ibotta, making it free and a $0.10 cent money maker. 
Next deal are on these Just Egg Folded. These are priced at $4.98. You'll get 100% cash back over on aisle and then an additional 5% cash back on Merrifield, which is 25 cents, making it free and a 25 cent moneymaker. Next deal are on these Blake's Seed Based Chewy Granola Bars. So you could get the granola bars or the crispy treats. These are priced at $3.98 or $4.48. So again, you'll pick one or the other. You'll get a hundred percent cash back over on aisle making them completely free next deal are on these knoppers these are priced at 356 each you want to pick up a total of two which will bring you to 712 you'll get back two dollars for my bada three dollars from swag bucks and then 430 kicks which is a dollar and 72 cents making the final cost 40 cents or just 20 cents each now, instead of picking up two, you can pick up just one priced at $3.56. You'll get the dollar back from Ibotta, a dollar from Swagbucks, and then the dollar and 72 cents back from Shopkick, making it free and a 16 cent moneymaker. All right, y'all, so this is everything that I picked up today. So unfortunately, again, this store didn't have much in stock. So some of the clips that I even shared with you guys weren't even from the store. It was just old clips that I had. Um... But I'm really hoping to get back to Walmart tomorrow to try to finish up my weekend warrior bonus and pick up the other deals that I wanted to grab. Um, but as far as everything I picked up today, total for everything came to $39.20. Got back $2.72 from Checkout 51, $8.50 from Swagbucks, five cents from Maryfield. Remember, over on Maryfield, even if you don't have a participating product, um, you'll still get five cents back for every receipt that you submit. Um, and then $18.25 back for my Ibotta, making the final cost $9 or about $0.48 cents per item. I was still happy with the total cost. Again, salty that I picked up the wrong raid. Um, yeah, that's it for me, guys. Drop a comment down below. Let me know if you're heading over to Walmart and what you're looking to pick up. If you're new to my channel, drop a comment down below letting me know that you're new so that I can welcome you. If you're not new, thank you guys so much for coming back. I really appreciate it. And if you've made it this far in the video, I want to thank you guys so much for watching and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.